Hello Taurus and welcome to Soul Sundays. Taurus, it's a quick three card spread, one for mind, body and soul for your week ahead. So let's get started. Universe and angels, messages and guides, my higher self, I call upon you now to give me clear and accurate reading for the sign of Taurus. Please show me what they need to hear, not what they want to hear for their week ahead. Can I please have three cards, one for mind, body and soul? Yay, Taurus! It's your time, baby cakes. We have a full moon in your sign this week uh, on the 12th. Um, I'm loving this reading for you already. It's beautiful energy. You guys haven't had the easiest of years. It's been a bit of up and down, topsy-turvy, left and right. Um, there's been a lot of rebirth coming through for you as well. And if you don't know what I'm talking about, go check out the Taurus yearly video. I'm about to do the next year's videos for everyone as well. Beautiful. Um, but you're starting off this reading in terms of your mindset very much at the beginning. You've drawn the card of the fool. Look at how beautiful that illustration is. It, it's like a rebirth almost, but um, I actually see this as greater than that. This is like a beginning of a new cycle. The full moon on the 12th, um, depending on where you're located in the world, is um, really going to be like a reset button for you. Um, you'll feel like you're beginning a new life cycle and wanting to herald that in. Um, what I love about the full, and you can see that depicted in this um, in this card is that she's naked. There's, there's nothing else she's bringing into the cycle, right? It's almost like letting go of any baggage that's kind of held you back. Um, and she looks like she's just having full of joy, right? And there's beautiful uh, rainbow behind her, a sunset, enthusiasm. It's absolutely gorgeous. Um, the card's called initiation for a reason because it's talking about something that sparked you to inspire new action. It's like you finally come out of this fog and you've got the energy to go forward. Um, and it says, the path of your dreams and desires will reveal itself with each step you take. So step by step, you're getting closer to your goals, Taurus. I'm going to read you a little blurb from that, the book, right? It says, um, the beginning announces something new. You've been asking for change and here it is. It's time to expand your inner and outer horizons. You are about to experience new loves and ideas as you seek the unique path that feels right for you. The first step is often the hardest, yet every great journey begins with just one step. Take a breath, know all is well, and stride into the new world of possibilities. If you've been waiting for a sign from the universe, then this is it. And then your card for your actual body message, your physical body right now, is unconditional joy. It's about giving gratitude, Taurus. Nine times out of ten, I see a lot of people, and myself, I've talked about this in other of my Empress videos, um, try and fix stuff when it comes to their body, try and look at a healthy way of eating or um, a healthy way of being in terms of their physicality and training and working out at the gym. But the truth is it starts with your, your, um, what you're putting out into the world, your mindset, right? Starting from the beginning, feeling joy, giving gratitude. If you want to achieve great things when it comes to your physical body and feeling balanced, then the message for this week is actually appreciating all that you have, all that your body has given you, all that your body has taken you through. Um, we've all got different stories and different paths, but I think sometimes we're a bit harsh in our physicality, um, expecting more and not actually understanding how amazing and unique our bodies are for everything that they support us through. Uh, and this week, your spiritual message is asking you to give joy to yourself, unconditional love and joy to yourself and be like, you know what? You've done pretty well this year through everything that you've been through it doesn't matter that you don't have abs or it doesn't matter that you've you know tried to change your diet three times and haven't been able to do it or that you um you know whatever it is for you I just want you to um this week be really kind to yourself and actually accept that um you're in a really good place right now, Taurus. And this full moon is fantastic for you. I can't speak enough. And then if that wasn't enough, just to tie it all in, you've drawn the card of core. Um, this speaks about the fact that at the core of any situation is the heart, right? And um, you are the heart. You are the choice. You don't need to seek uh, justification or validation from anyone. All the answers that you need are in, within yourself. Um, so it could be speaking about offsetting external pressures by seeking inner calm. So finding your inner balance, finding that unconditional joy as you begin something new, start something fresh, whether that be a relationship, a new job, um, maybe it's a new cycle of life, like what I was talking about for you. For some of you, you've been completing a karmic cycle. Um, and this is also talking about, um, independence, wealth, whatever it is, right? Just when you, if you're not sure about any decision you have to make, I want you to remember that at the core of everything is your choice, right? You hold the answers. Um, 
Yeah, and, and they're, they're asking me to tell you to understand that too, the centre of existence um, is everywhere. So this centre here that is your core, that is your knowledge, that is your well-being, is in everything that you see and everything that you do. And when you're in flow and harmony, like what the cards are showing me right now for your sign this week, and you should be because you've got that full moon in your sign, things will just flow naturally. You won't need to get second opinions or ask people for advice because it will just seem like it's all coming together. And it is coming together. Whatever this fresh start is, this new beginning, it looks absolutely brilliant. A fantastic week for you, Head of Taurus. I wish you much love and light. Take care.